<laughs> so, oh wait, what what day is it? It's Halloween! And it's also Baby's First Halloween! Yay! Oh, mama's knee tastes good. Oh, 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 give me mama's knee. Oh, 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 nom 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 on mama's knee. Oh, oh, he's going for the broccoli. He likes broccoli. Look at that face. That's not an I like broccoli face. <laughs> That's a what the hell did you give me face? He <laughs> did not like it. He went like this. He does that all the time. The first time. <laughs> first fix of the day. So me and Troy walked through the merch area. You guys know the merch area? So merchy. 10, 20 times today together and neither one of us seen the problem. The problem was is Keith heats plastic. So I really quickly threw up the roof and didn't give a crap about it because number one, I really didn't think it was gonna rain yet, but it did. Right there in the plastic where you see it folding and stuff and everything all cool like, it wasn't folding. It was going like this. <laughs> It's full of water, so Keith had to go out there and cut a hole in it and come back and staple plastic on it, right? Uh, fix the coordinates, bring out solarium, relocate the two cameras, fix the circuit, no problem, clean the mask, move light if you can, fix hanging, fl fix hanging flame lamp, plastic, uh, donation booth up front, take care of that already. Annoy Troy. That's being taken care of every day. T minus like three hours, so this is Keith. This is Keith in stress mode. <laughs> it's the last night of the haunt, bro, or you said. Um, I honestly am. Usually I'm not. Usually I'm kind of... I mean, it's upsetting. It's like, oh, it's over for another year. But at the same time, it's like, oh, it's over for another year. <laughs> it's really depressing this year because it's not just the end. It's the end for now for Troy and Keith. Don't make... God dang it. Don't make me get all, like, freaking emotional and stuff. Don't you guys cry. know that Keith is moving in March. Don't, don't cry. If you cry... Dude, March, <laughs> shut up. Um, I'm not sure if he's going to vlog, but um, he's planning on doing his own haunt when he moves to Montana. So what city are you going to be in for people that might be around Montana? I'm going to be about 30 miles west of Butte in a little town called Anaconda, Montana. And I uh, already thought of a name, already have everything set up, but you guys don't get to know. <laughs> not until next year when I start vlogging. Yeah, you should start. I do plan on it, and I do plan on having my own haunt in Ooh, I really got to thank for that is Num Nuts here and you guys, because had I not come back and got involved with this, I would have never done it. Here's a view that I don't think that you guys have seen before. Um, that's the kids' room, egress over there, pallet maze over there, egress again right there, going to the dining room right here. I don't know, guys. It's just kind of reflection right now. You know, this has been an awesome awesome journey and awesome build this year and I don't want to bring anybody down but this haunt right here as it exists right now will never exist again once we start tearing it down granted the night hasn't started yet it's going to be an awesome freaking night it's just I was up here uh, mounting the camera for um, for the live uh, feed tonight and I just started looking over the haunt and it's like gonna miss this old bird <laughs> or this old bat ah the smell of fog. This is the last run day, guys. I've said that before. Anyway, everybody is going and helping out. It's the last night, if I mention that. It's the last night. I know, right? Austin, it's the last night. Uh, I know. Boy. Keith, last night. Thank God. Keith has been stressing hardcore. Keith has been stressing more than Troy has. I know. I think there's a fine line between fog and smoke. That looks like smoke. Phoenix, it's your first Halloween. It's your first Halloween. Well, it's not really doing much for our haunt, but for the neighbor's yard, it's doing great. It's been challenging. We've had a lot of people call out today. So um, the schedule still looks full. We're missing a few people, mainly the entrance and security and a couple drop panels and a greeter. But no, hey, other than that, everything's going fine. We have 22 minutes until we start and go live. I'm just about ready to start turning on all the projectors and cameras, fun stuff like that. Have I mentioned to you guys that it's the last day going out with a bang? People are showing up, making the official trek through the haunt, 
Just to make sure that everybody's ready. We'll go ahead and everybody get in their places. The next people that come through are going to be live. Are you ready? No. What are we getting ready for? We're ready to torture people. <laughs> okay. We're gonna get them. Are you guys ready? Yes. Let's do this. Ah. House lights off. Dude, I came around the corner and I couldn't even tell that he was, he was here. I was like, where's Austin? He's like, right here. I'm like, oh crap. Go! Hey, calm down. It does sound like a taser. Oh god, not more of this. It sounds like rape! Oh shit. Take it on me, not me! Take it on me! That's funny. This is the mom and the little kid out front. They're sitting there laughing at their kids that went through that started getting scared. That was great. So, I'm gonna film you. I've already talked about the mom behind me. You hear them laughing? They're laughing at their the kids in the back getting scared. Oh, I know. Huh? I know. That's funny. Yeah. She, she told the little boy, she's like, you ain't going in there. You're already too scared. <laughs> I hear that. That's great. Say hi, Phoenix. Hi. Hi, Phoenix. Hi. <laughs> I was trying to find the kid that was screaming and crying, but I couldn't find him. Sorry for the couple that came through the back here, I guess. Ah, oh, dang it. I missed it. I wanted to see the little one and cry. I want to see a pig. Oh my gosh, look at the line out here. This is the throw light. The first thing is the throw light. Holy crap, guys, so this is a busy night. All these people right here are all lined up to go in. This is the busiest that we have ever been by far. Hi, baby hunter. Hi, who's all these people? So, babe. Yeah. How long until the cops are called? It, sorry. <laughs> the lady that's up there on the on the right, that's with the little camera right there. Her and her boy just came through, and I was like, "Did you guys like it?" And she said, "It was great." And I said, "He made it." And she said, "He peed." I'm like, "That's great." And here's the street when it's busy. Oh, there's a Keith, but here's the street when it's busy. <laughs> and the line is dwindling down. Lori Lee's been walking around with a smile on her face. Another satisfied customer. <laughs> There were people telling us that on the blogs it was actually saying that this has been rated better than Fright Fest. Wow. Yeah. We had like separate groups of like five to ten people and they're like, this is better than Fright Fest. Wow. Yeah. That's awesome. And then we had a group of people and I guess this is like their third time coming already. And they went to like three different ones where you have to pay and they're like, it wasn't worth it. They're like, this is why we keep coming back. They went to two and they were like, it's not worth it. This is sad guys. It is officially over Shad Panda. We're gonna go meet in the dining room real quick, but um, as far as the run, Halloween 2013, ow, 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 Another one in the jack-o'-lantern. This is like my perch uh, center egress and projector and looking out over the, the living dining room. And this is everybody. This is everybody for night four. <laughs> Say happy haunting. Happy <laughs> all right, guys. So my, my main question, I mean, all of you, some of you were here last year. Most of you guys are new. I appreciate everybody, seriously, from the bottom of our hearts for coming out here and doing this because yes, it really means you. a lot. If you think that you had a major role, if you think that you had a small role, there is no small role because it takes all of us to make this run. And I think that you guys kind of saw that when we didn't have people in a certain room. It's like all of us. And I just want to make sure that everybody had fun. Did we all have fun? Yeah! All right. Cool. No, and, um, no. Oh, stop. Oh, 
<laughs> wow. That was rude. Really, Keith? You just pictures. went through broke stuff. Was I vlog bombing? Yeah. <laughs> Last night, uh, the winners for the contest were the drop panel hallway again. Yeah. Um, I don't know who has won tonight. It was so. Corn Maze. Was it? Yep. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Who was second? Yeah. This, this one lady said she she crapped herself in the kids' room. Yeah, that was great. I heard that from the corn maze. She actually crapped herself? She crapped herself in the kids' room. She was checking herself by the pallet maze. Wow. Wow. That's it's <laughs> okay. Guys, real quick, I want to thank you guys for an awesome freaking year this year. What about the Absolutely. Huh? What about the females? Okay. <laughs> All of you, I want to thank yeah. for an yeah. awesome freaking year this year. Sexist. Sexist. Huh? Now you did it. You started a war. I thought it was 1960. Excuse me. <laughs> All you guys are appreciated, and I really do appreciate everything you guys have done. So yeah. thank you very much. If anybody wants to help volunteer to help me take this down, that'd be awesome. Yes, please. Um, but we also have the annual Halloween stick burning. It's usually kind of short notice due to weather and scheduling and whatnot. But when all this comes down, like all the two by fours that are too small or broken pieces of wood, the fire pit that's back here in Egress, we light this up and we have a fire. It's all it's it's, it's all ages. It's all ages. It's B Y O S, which stands for Bring Your Own sh Stuff. <laughs> um, but everybody that's acted this year or volunteered um, is absolutely welcome to come out. We we have tried to do the actor competition just to you know try to give back to you guys a little bit. Um, and I realize that everybody didn't get everybody didn't get something. But before you leave today, you will get something. And I mean, I hope that a bumper sticker and or pen will be okay uh, for you guys. Um, and being part of the group, you know, I mean, it was a really good team, and we raised a lot of food for Northwest Harvest, you know, I mean, yeah. we did a really good job. And and we couldn't have done it without you guys, I mean, so thank you. how many memories have we brought to all these people that came through? I didn't need a number. I Okay. So you guys, um, see me. We made someone pay. Again. And poop. And poop. Yes. Yes. That's such an accomplishment. Okay, so happy haunting on the count of three. And it'll be one, two, three, go. Not one, two, on three. But one, two, three, happy haunting. I'm trying to do the whole... I know, right? All right. You get the reference. Thank you. One, two, three. Happy haunting! Last it's time. over, guys. <laughs> All right. Excellent haunting with you, sir. <laughs> Trash duty. Got to keep the neighborhood happy. Lori Lee is going through the pictures of Halloween. Keep going. Oh, good. You did take some night ones. That's awesome. Except for the stupid porch light I forgot to turn off. It's a slideshow. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, it was packed tonight, guys. So, what'd you think? You were smiling half the night. I took some drugs. Wow. <laughs> oh my god. What the hell are you doing? Am I the only normal one here? No. Okay. Yeah, right. You're my normal. Baby. I know, right? Look at my what? baby. No. Oh. Oops. Yeah, you touch it. Oh, there's that. My stress level was less than Keith's. That's ridiculous. It really is. I wasn't that stressed. Was crazy. Never I wasn't having a good time running around, giggling, and helping people. Usually, guys, <laughs> this is how it happens. This is Troy. And I'm over here, like, just calm down, dude. We're good. Just chill. Let's have fun. It's going to be all right. Not today. It's like we switched. The places. tables were turned. It is time for cock. Cock in bed sounds like a good idea, doesn't it? Little Giles, just want to thank you again for the live feeds. Even with the troubles, we had a great time chatting amongst ourselves. You are putting on an awesome event and are truly an inspiration to others. Keep up the good work, everyone. Happy Halloween. Just curious, 
when do the I Survived the Hillmouth Live Feed Blackout 2013 t-shirts go in the mail? Haha. <laughs> oh, you guys are so funny. I don't know what to say. I, I just want to thank you guys for, you know, <laughs> dealing with the lack of audio and the lack of live feed. And, yeah, I need I need to find a different venue than YouTube to stream we live. We didn't go down tonight, did we? Uh, we did for a couple minutes, yeah. Other than that, it was... It was but I never got the... the he never went and put the extra light in there, so I never, they couldn't see. Yeah, so seeing was kind of difficult, but if I put the extra light in there, then their scare, or their part wouldn't have been that much. It would have been too light in there, no matter what light bulb I used. So it was fine. We did what we did. It was cool. Thank you for watching. Adam Owens, um, let us know how your haunt came out. Hopefully you were able to have it. I know a lot of people had weather problems. Thank goodness this year we did not have any weather problems. You know, oh, it rained a little it was, bit. Oh, it was nice. But, um, this morning and then it stopped. Yeah, we were good, which is really not typical. Yeah. <laughs> usually all the wing were soaked. Yeah, usually it's going... Uh, little Giles, again, uh, talking about if you want cardboard boxes, go to your local liquor store. Uh, our liquor stores are no longer state ran, so they're just like regular privately owned liquor stores and the ones around us no longer hand out cardboard boxes. Because I did go there, I was going to vlog it and just ended up cutting the material out. So we thank you guys for all of your comments. Um, what do you think about the haunt and this year's experience? Um, I was worried when you first started building it and I was confused about the way you were doing it, but I love the way it turned out. Um, I was a little disappointed that the radio advertising didn't bring in more people, but uh, it was still cool. Um, and it was just fun seeing all the people going through and having such a good time. Final count tonight, by the way, guys, was 465. When I went out there talking to the crowds, there was like 100 and something people in line, and that was just one of the times I went out there, so I know that's got to be off. Yeah. What do you think? I was going to go through and count everybody on video. Because <laughs> he's anal like that. Wow. <laughs> I demand a recount. <laughs> <laughs> it, it, it was You're definitely not Bush. more. It was uh, definitely more. And I don't have one either. Oh, what? Whoa. <laughs> So here we were filming COC and then the camera just shuts off because it was full. I had that much stuff tonight. Um, it is 3 o'clock in the morning on the 1st of November. I'm going to bed, guys, but I did want to tell you, um, all, all of you guys, uh, all of us say thank you and a happy haunting. Um, thank you for watching. Thank you for dealing with us through the live feed if you caught any of that. And um, the scare videos, I want to try and get on them. Uh, they're going to get done after the takedown and the breakdown and everything uh the teardown so anyway whatever i don't know what i'm saying i'm suffering from sleep deprivation i'm tired i hope you guys had an awesome halloween and we'll see you tomorrow happy haunting